Right guys, welcome back to another video. This will just be a, a quick comparison of the blood oxygen readings using this um, pulse oximeter and comparing it with the Galaxy Watch 3, Galaxy Watch 4, Galaxy Watch 4 Classic, Amazfit GTR 3 Pro and the Fossil Gen 6. So we'll see which one has the best reading compared to the meter itself and obviously which one does the reading quicker see how long they take to actually do a reading. Right, first we'll start with the Galaxy Watch 3. Right, let's try again. Right, we've got a reading. It says 98, also shows the beats per minute. This one says 99, and the beats per minute is the same, 67. So the heart rate is exactly the same on the watch and on the meter, and it's just out by one for the blood oxygen. But the only thing with this, um, the watch free, it does take a long time to read and you got to elevate your arm. Right, next we'll try the Galaxy Watch 4. Right, here's the Galaxy Watch 4. Right, got a reading 97. That's saying 99. So it's a bit off. But the heart rate, as you can see, the heart rate is perfect. Exactly the same. Right, here's the Watch 4 Classic. Right, got a reading straight away. 98 again. It's 99 in the meter. 68. The heart rate's a bit different. There's a Mace Fit GTR 3 Pro. Right, it's come up with 99 and on here we have 99 much quicker than any of the samsung watches can't straight away 99 percent 99 percent but the only thing it doesn't show the um heart rate so it's just blood oxygen if you want the heart rate you have to go into the heart rate um app itself and then do it from there And last, we got the Fossil Gen 6. Right, let's just try again. Let's come with 97. Let's come up with 89. Alright, let's try again.
Right, it's got 98, 97, so it's pretty close. And once again, just like the GTR 3 Pro, we only got uh, blood oxygen reading, no heart rate. So if you want to do the heart rate, you have to go into the heart rate part itself. Right guys, that was testing the blood oxygen and comparing it with the pulse oximeter against these um, five watches here. You have the Galaxy Watch 3, the Watch 4, Watch 4 Classic, the uh, Mazefit GTR 3 Pro, and the Fossil Gen 6. Out of the five, the quickest, uh, I think the most accurate, and the cheapest out of the lot, is the Mazefit GTR 3 Pro. Does it pretty quick, and um, you don't have to bend your arm or elbow or anything. Just keep it, just put the watch on, make sure it's tight enough, and gets the job done. With the Samsung watches, you have to bend your arm at an angle to get a, get a proper reading. So, um, so it's not really straightforward. So you get a lot of failed attempts. And the Fossil Gen 6, same thing. Near enough with the Amaze Fit. Basically it takes a few tries and it's just maybe one 1% 1 out. But it's much quicker than the Samsung watches. So out of five, the best one for blood oxygen reading, like I said, is the Mazefit GTR 3 Pro and it's actually the cheapest out of the lot. Anyway guys, if you've got any questions, leave them down in the comments. Don't forget to like, share and subscribe. Thanks for watching and I'll see you guys in the next one.